Hi, let's get you started with the basics of your Zendesk support account. While you've got the option of setting up any number of channels to communicate with your customers, the staple for any use case or industry is still email. You might have a single email address that you funnel all the customer inquiries through, like support at yourcompany.com, or you might have many different email addresses for the unique types of requests you receive. Either way, they can all be forwarded right into your account so that tickets are automatically created for your agents to manage. Now let's talk people. First, you've got your agents who are logging into your account to respond to tickets. To reflect your own internal teams, departments, or subject matter experts, you can group your agents into, well, groups. Once these are set up, you can assign tickets to the entire group so that each member is notified and the first available agent can reply. In addition to reporting on the workload or performance of individual agents, you'll now be able to do the same for your different groups. Next, where would you be without your customers? In Zenda support, your customers are referred to as end users and can be grouped into organizations, which most commonly represent companies. In this example, you can see that Mary and Hannah are both members of the Eat Well organization, while Elena and Brian belong to the Obscura Designs organization. You can easily see all tickets submitted by any member of an organization right from one profile in your account. You can even enable domain mapping, which will automatically place new end users into the right organization based on the domain in their email address. If you already have a long list of customers or companies that you support, you can bulk upload them into your account with a simple CSV file. Now, quick question for you. What types of requests are your customers submitting and what information do your agents need to solve those requests? To track this information in your account, you can create ticket fields for your customers or agents to fill out. These can be set up as drop-down menus, checkboxes, date fields, and more so that you can categorize your tickets in whatever way makes the most sense for your business. This also turns your tickets into valuable data that you can report upon down the line when analyzing the types of requests you're fielding most often. Those that are taking the most time to resolve and those that are leading to happy or unhappy customers. And that's the basics.